have a weekly lab that goes along with this class, and what we're doing this week is going to test the sensory receptors of honeybees, specifically their taste receptors, uh, by presenting them with different sugar kinds. We learned earlier in the semester about different kinds of sensory neurons and how they are perceived by the brain. So a serial dilution is just a series of dilutions and each um, like solution will be more dilute than the last. So we're just taking a portion of like the solution before and adding it to the next one. These are monosaccharides, some things are disaccharides, so things like glucose and fructose like are monosaccharides. But the one things like sucrose, for example, is a disaccharide. So it just basically means two monosaccharides stuck together to each other. And uh, these all chemically are different enough that um, some animals can tell the difference. So we're going to see if it right now again. And then some of these other sugars that we're going to be looking at are somewhat odd and don't occur in nectar. And so we'll see how specific their uh, taste buds are. We have these little kebab skewers. <laughs> this is super high tech. That's the thing about field ecology is it's really high tech. Um, so this is um, spray adhesive, general purpose. And uh, just spray like a little wad of it on a paper towel or something and it reaches a certain tackiness and then you put just a tiny little dot on the end of a stick and um, then you stick it on the back of a bee and then the bee is just stuck there to the stick and then you can take it and do whatever you want with it. If you do it carefully, you can actually sort of flick the, the bee off and it will detach from the glue and it will, it'll be fine. So whether it survives is sort of up to them. So when you dip their feet, in something that they think tastes sweet, their mouth parts come down and they start feeding from it. 